is difference between analog and digital synthesizer and devices like EQs, compressors etc. And how we created our virtual emulation of analog synthesizers and devices. Let's start with oscillators. Digital oscillators are sharp, linear, precise, numb and always the same. While analog oscillators have exponential shape, round spike, harmonics, changing tone little bit, and include small amount of analog noise caused by circuit's temperature. Analog oscillator is changing its shape, tone in time which makes natural, organic sound. Also amplitude envelope, modulation envelope etc. is not linear, it has exponential shapes, spikes are not sharp, they are round, also envelope signal, voltage has some analog noise and miniature vibrations and harmonics. Temperature of circuit makes little bit of analog noise, higher temperature and older components like resistors, transistors, capacitors, means more noise, this noise is included also in analog envelope voltage signal which modulates various parameters. While digital MIDI signal is always the same, analog voltage note signal which modulate frequency or better said note of analog oscillator is changing in time, not a lot, like 0, 1% max, but is cause natural detuning of oscillator, when two oscillators are running together it creates fat massive sound and unison type effect. When digital signal is louder than 0 decibel, spike of this signal above this level is cut which makes clipping and ugly saturation, while in analog domain spikes of loud signal are not clipped, they are saturated which creates nice soft and fat sound. Transients are round and pleasant to ears. In real analog circuit, synthesizer, compressor or equalizer, not just loud output is saturated, but various individual modules are saturated separately at its input and output stages. Oscillator module, filter module circuit are saturated separately. Also in equalizers input and output coil transformers, individual frequency boost circuits are saturated separately. In analog devices all parameters are voltage signal which includes temperature noise and is little bit changing in time from 0 to 1%. While digital parameters are always the same, static and precise. In analog devices and circuits almost everything is non-linear. Everything is changing in time. Every inner circuit and module creates temperature plus noise. While digital filter is precise, stable and numb sounding, analog filter is non-linear, produces higher harmonics, saturation and again little bit of noise. Its frequency is also changing little bit in time, just a few tenths of a percent, it is caused by instability of electronic components like resistors and capacitors and real world physics. Digital synthesizer is usually like robot, it sounds precise, but static, boring, unnatural and numb. Analog synthesizer is like real animal, warm, alive, changing, moving, organic. Analog signal is created by real voltage changing in time. Digital signal is created by zeros and ones, bits. When digital signal is processed or boosted with equalizers just numbers are changed, not real signal which may create cold sound. Saturation and distortion creates phenomenon of higher harmonics, which is also described as color of sound. 
Simply saturated signal automatically creates very quiet multiples of the original signal at higher frequencies, this is physical law. But problem in digital simulations is that if multiplies of original signal are higher than sampling frequency 44,1 or 47 kHz they are returned back to signal as digital artifacts which create harshness and unpleasant sound. We are using our own special techniques to eliminate this behavior including oversampling etc. If your project is in 48 kHz and we are using oversampling in a signal of our digital device, synthesizer or effect is often working in oversampled frequency 96 kHz or higher. Analog sounds natural to ears and brain because it is similar to real natural signals and instruments. All real instruments are changing their sound and quasi-parameters in time. While digital synthesizer raw effect has all parameters static, analog device modulates other circuits with real voltage. Because of instability of electronic components this voltage and parameters are always changing in time. This makes analog device quasi-living, organic sounding system. Nothing is static like in digital device, everything is changing in time, just few percents but overall sound is constantly evolving, is organic, fat, natural and warm. Thanks to our virtual analog circuit technology, detailed measuring in our analog labs and precise capturing, we recreated mentioned analog behavior in digital world. Please listen to our instruments, effects, try demo and compare.